we will learn the concept of Euler's inequality today. Uh, but we will use a problem to understand its application first. So this problem is from ISI entrance. It also appeared in uh, some Soviet Olympiads. The problem says that uh, it's given circum radius is two times the inner radius for a particular triangle. So in a triangle, it's a very special case. This is not always the case. So the circum radius, which I denote by capital R, is equal to two times the in radius. What can you say about this particular um, triangle? So for example, could you say, maybe I can put it here, uh, could you say that this triangle is equilateral? Uh, maybe it is isosceles or maybe it is right angle it depends on how you how much you can say about the triangle now uh, this problem heavily uses the Euler's inequality or the identity and it's part of the Chinta Math Olympiad and ISI entrance program as well uh, link in the description will tell you more about it but let's look uh, at the solution of this problem so what is the Euler's inequality? So to understand it, let's draw a picture. Uh, we have this uh, triangle ABC. And we have two points in the triangle. Let's call these O and I. So O is the circumcenter. Circumcenter and I is the in center. We are interested in the distance between O and I. This is the context of this problem. So maybe I can just zoom in a little bit more. Okay, here you go. So what is the distance between O and I? Let's call this distance D. So the distance, the, this is Euler's formula, the square of the distance has a very nice property. It is square of the circum radius minus two times circum radius times in radius. So circum radius squared minus two times circum radius circum radius times in radius. So this is the idea. This is the formula. So we need, uh, of course, we need a proof of this. In a subsequent video and it also in our website, we uh, have a proof of this. And it's also available in many geometry books. It's a classical result. Now, how do we use this particular formula here? Let me use it in this problem, in the context of this problem. So this problem says that 2r is equal to 2 times small r. That is, uh, circum radius is equal to 2 times in radius. So d square is, we know it's equal to r square minus 2r small r. So if we take capital R common, then we have r minus 2r. But since r is equal to 2r, we know that this distance is 0. So this is this uh, difference is zero. So this is r times zero, which is zero. Now, uh, this, this tells us that the distance between O and I, this distance is zero in this particular triangle. In this very special triangle where we know that r is given to be equal to two times r. This is not always the case. It's a very special case. So, circumcenter at the in center, their distance is zero. When does that happen? For what kind of triangle do we have this situation? Uh, so, I think you will be able to finish off this problem from here. Mm, think about it. 
when what kind of triangle do we have circumcenter and the in center to be the same point um, i'll give you a little bit more hint circumcenter is created by joining the midpoints of the three sides and they all meet at a single point it's a theorem one has to prove that and the in center is created by joining all the angle bisectors so in this special triangle abc the perpendiculars to the sides are also the angle bisectors so these two lines will be the same perpendiculars to the sides perpendicular bisectors of the sides are same as the angle bisectors can you tell me uh, in what kind of triangle this thing happens and if you if you can please put the answer in the comment in the description and uh, i will see you in the next one keep on doing great mathematics bye